So today is a really important day. I've officially ran 100 days consecutively at least a mile. And for the last 10 days, I've been doing a minimum of two miles. So back in October, a friend of mine, Sean, told me that he was gonna do a little club where everybody would run a mile a day and see who could be the last one still doing a mile. So the goal with this streaking challenge is just to be the last person still doing a mile every day. See, the difficult part about this run is not the mile. Honestly, the hardest part for me has just been consistently every day knowing when I wake up, I have to run. I've done some big adventures during this and realized that like running 20 miles in one day and then having to get up and run a mile is not ideal. And honestly, it's not that I couldn't run a mile. It's just a sure fact of every day you have to get up and run another mile. Consistency. It's the part that I probably suck at the most or probably it's the part that uh, I just struggle with. I also know that I've got to build a new pattern in my life and consistency is a lot more valuable going into these next 10 to 20 years of my life. For the longest time, the Suffer Club has been really focused on honestly suffering, pushing yourself to the uh, extreme limit, where I do believe that there is still major value in that. At this moment in time in my life, I have found a lot more value in being consistent and maybe small suffer sessions, not large ones. Let me explain. One of the main reasons why I joined this one mile a day run streak is because of this place. This is Kannapolis High School. I have been given the privilege to hang out with the cross country and track team. And I've just been able to watch the consistency of the students. Most of these kids start with cross country to winter track to spring track, and they're running consistently every day. Every day, some type of warm up drill. Their coach, Nick Buckwell, has just bred consistent incremental growth. But just the consistency of every day logging miles, not fast miles, just logging consistent miles, and how much of a game changer it has been to every athlete. See, I've watched kids be super consistent and throw down like major personal records in the mile and the 5K and the 800 and the 4x800. And it's just these kids being consistent. And honestly, I just modeled after what they're doing. They just come out here to this track and run consistently. Coach has them doing very specific workouts to build certain strengths and it has made a massive difference in their life and especially in mine. So in this streaking challenge, there's been quite a few other individuals running it with us. I think it started out with like 18 or 20 individuals. At this moment, there's I think six, my son, Miles, Nina, Sean, Brock, Daniel, and Christopher. I think those are the only ones that are left and I'll be interested to see who wakes up on day 101. Honestly, the biggest thing that I have been excited about this daily challenge and kind of like my biggest takeaway, it's the mental strength that probably I'm much more proud of in a consistent 100 day streak. But now that we've hit that, and cleared out of the way. Let's just see how long this can last. Super proud of myself. Super proud of all the other competitors that are still in it with me.